Hi, in this video you're going to learn how to subtract two vectors. So here we are, we're given two vectors, vector a and vector b, and we're asked to find the difference between them. In other words, vector b minus a. And whenever we want to subtract vectors, what we want to do is look at the vector which is actually b plus negative a. Okay. That's going to be equivalent to b minus a, obviously. So what we have to ask ourselves is, what is this vector, negative a? Well, negative a is the same vector as a, but in the opposite direction. So 180 degrees opposite to the vector a. So what we're going to do is add two vectors, really. We're going to add b and we're going to add a, but we're going to add it in the opposite direction. So as always, what I want to start off with is a coordinate system, so I'm going to draw uh, my north-south line because I know I have vectors which are north and south, and I'm going to draw an east-west line. So here's east, and here's north, and I want to start with my vector b. That's the first vector that I want to deal with. I want to go b plus negative a. So vector b is a vector two and a half meters in length and it points south. So let me try and make this a little bit thicker. It shows up. So this is 2.5 meters south. And to this vector I want to add vector negative a. So normally when I draw a I would draw a at 40 degrees west of north so I would go off in this direction. right? 40 degrees towards west from north. But 180 degrees opposite to that is vector negative a. So I'm going to add a, negative a, sorry, in this direction. So 5 meters in length, and it makes an angle of 40 degrees here. And this is 5 meters. And then my resultant vector a minus b is this vector here. Or sorry, b minus a. So I need to know the length of this vector and I need to know the direction. So I'll need to find this angle. So as always what I'm looking for here is a cosine law to find the magnitude. And angle C is going to be this angle in the triangle opposite to my side C. And obviously that angle is going to be 140 degrees, right? The 180 minus this 40, so 140 degrees. So this is going to be um, 5 squared plus 2.5 squared minus 2 times 5 times 2.5 times cosine of 140. So when we put all of that into our calculator, what we find is that that vector is 7.1 meters in length. And again, that makes sense. It looks like it's obviously the longest side. It has to be longer than 5. So I'm happy with that answer so far. Now to find the direction, I use my sine law, so sine of that angle over the opposite side, which in this case is the 5 meters, is going to be equal to the sine of this angle, 140, over the 7.1, which we just calculated. And again, putting that into my calculator, I find that it is an angle of 27 degrees. So 
final answer, B minus A, is 7.1 meters at 27 degrees east of south. Okay, so that's how we subtract two vectors. Uh, basically what we're doing is adding the vector that we're subtracting but in the opposite direction, so 180 degrees opposite. Everything else is the same, you're just following the same rules for adding vectors. Hopefully that example makes sense uh, with along with the examples from the textbook. Uh, if you want any uh, further clarification as always track me down in class and I'll be glad to help you out.